And so I'm thinking as I go, if I've had a brain injury, so I am in a medical situation basically. And um, it seems to me that the main things in my life that I'm doing are drinking water and urinating. So I, get, I drink water and I go to the toilet pretty much all the time and it seems like the main thing I do in life. And it is frustrating, but I know it's essential. But um, I'm thinking about something now to do with my situation. And I know that I would have been using a catheter, a urinary catheter, at some point in the past. So I've been looking into catheters now and how they are used. And I'm really surprised at how they function. And I can't believe that a tube can be inserted into the penis. It doesn't make sense to me and it's kind of unbelievable that it's possible to insert something into the penis. And I wouldn't have thought that was possible. And one thing that surprised me is how did some man realise it would be possible to do such a thing? Because it seems insane when I'm on the face of it. But um, some man had the genius to realise it would be possible and invented the technique. So I'm sure it's been used in my case, in my surgeries. And I find it unbelievable. And um, I'm wondering if I'd be able to insert one myself if I should need to. So I have been looking into it and I'm just surprised that such technique was invented. How did some man even conceive it would be possible to do such a thing? It is very impressive that some man had the genius to invent such a device. I'm very surprised that we have such a thing. And on the face of it, it just seems impossible to use. Obviously, it's it's fine. It seems like it would be very uncomfortable. But maybe it's not such a big deal, but it just seems like it would be. It is very surprising.